I'd like to say thank you to Owen and Pembroke and SBS for the very warm welcome this evening. Um, it's wonderful to be here with the Emma 6 class. Uh, the next time we'll be here together, um, it will be farewell from Emma 5. Oh. At the greatest college of Oxford. <laughs> There's an ancient Chinese saying that when the student is ready, the teacher arrives. We all arrived here as students, ready to learn about management and leadership, about finance and economics, about strategy and all of its flavors. But we also came here ready to learn about ourselves, about friendships which transcend companionship and entertainment to those which capabilities and new ways of thinking, internal resources which we often neglect or overlook under more comfortable circumstances. Here in Oxford, and especially with the EMBA, the distinction between teachers and students is often less defined than in a more ordinary classroom. Everyone in the class has been a teacher to me. It's also been said that an education is what you're left with when you've forgotten everything that you've learned at university. Thinking back to September 2007, when I attended an open evening at SBS, and the formal college dinner at Worcester, I think that must be what Stefan meant when he says that the EMBA is transformational. The data we may well forget, but the knowledge, wisdom, and camaraderie will remain. So as we begin to prepare for our next step, after we finish the EMBA, I challenge all of us to remember that we will always remain both teachers and students. We may be teachers in the boardroom and students in the lunchroom. We may be students in the lecture theater and teachers in the EMBA dining room or in SR11. After each module, we part and go our separate ways back to our real lives which in my experience has departed ever further from status quo with the conclusion of each module. So let's not forget when we leave the business school and these ancient, when the curtain falls on our grand finale of students here, that Oxford and SBS have granted us this most captivating opportunity for an even greater encore in the wider global theater. And indeed, that's the very reason that we're here, so that the channels of teaching and learning may flow distant from this timeless fountain of education and leadership that Oxford is. So ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, please raise your glasses to teachers and students. Thank you.